Hello, my friends. Welcome back to another episode of The Long Dark with me, Notorious BLT. So, last time we went fishing, and well, first off, last time we actually made it to our destination, which was a feat in itself. Uh. <gasps> oh, crap. Bark barks? Do I see bark barks? Is that a bark bark? Is that a bark bark? I don't know. I can't tell. Am I, well, am I? Oh my god, I'm standing up on the workbench. Do I see bark barks? Okay, well, we're warm in here. Let's... Oh god, it's terrible. Oh, there's... Okay, there's one wolf, I see. Just one? I could... Ooh, we could chase the deer into the... Wolf. Why don't we try to do that? Let's try to chase the deer into the wolf. Because if we can get the wolf to kill the deer, then that means we save bullets. Or arrows. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, please don't hurt yourself. So last time we also talked about puzzle rooms, which I thought were super cool, because I just did the first one that I've ever done. Um, and it was super duper fun, and I would totally encourage other people, if, as long as you can afford it, to go and do it yourself, because, good lord, it was a good time, and uh, I want people to have a good time. What? What is... Oh, we got, like, rose hips and such. I know I can eat the cattail things as well, but I'm not too keen on that at the moment. How... Okay, we're still not even cold enough to worry. You need to... Yeah, go that way. No, other way. Other way, you stupid. Oh, Jesus. No, you need to... I... That was a terrible miss. That was a terrible miss. Okay, don't... Actually, don't run. Don't run. You're just going to cause yourself issues if you do. Let's pick up the arrow. Which may be a little busted now. You know, here's the thing, though. With that wolf lurking about, I don't feel super comfortable fishing. So, yeah. Makes it difficult, you know? Do I shoot the wolf? Do I feebly attempt to chase deer into it? I don't know. I would like to go up that stream, though. Oh, there's just picking cattails, or uh, uh, cattails, which I don't really have a desire to do at the moment. I suppose for now. What? I mean, hmm. okay, let's think about this. Yes, the wolf can kill deer for us. That is true. However, however, the wolf will also cause problems for us later on because it's going to try to kill us. So I think the best course of action is to kill it. Plus, it's going to give us some meat, as well. God damn it! Aim. Are you, oh, I didn't hit it. Or, or did I? Did I just scare it? No, I didn't even hit it. It just—it's running away. That's all. All right, I gotta get closer. God damn it! Wait, where? Anybody else want some? God, I thought there was another wolf for a second. Jeez. You scared the crap out of me, dude. Alright, let's hurt. You were a tiny one. There's like no meat on you at all. Actually, you know what? We should probably take the guts, too. Yeah, let's take the guts. Yeah. Take the guts. Uh, the reason I say we should take the guts is I, I, I think I actually have the stuff to make a bow as long as I can get guts. And as long as we can cure these guts, we'll have the stuff to make another survival bow. And I think our bow is actually starting to lose... Oh, oh god. Starting to lose their ability uh, quite quickly. So I'd like to avoid that as much as possible. Alright, we have a decent amount of daylight left. Let's continue up this way. And plus, we're, we're still at 1C... Uh, 1 degree Celsius. So we're still fine in terms of... Uh, our 
I'm getting a little nervous. Uh, in, in terms of our temperature, although it is snowing, um, yeah, we're getting a bit soggy. That may be another problem with our busted up cabin. Come to think of it, yeah, that could be another problem with the busted up cabin. Because if it's, dang it. Yeah, if, if it's going to let a lot of snow in, that means that we might get wet. But I don't know. I think maybe if you get the shielded thing, you, you start losing wetness. I, I, this is just a complete um, speculation on my part. I really have absolutely no idea. That was a very tiny wolf, though. Wait, how many bullets do we have in this thing? Okay, so we've, right, we only fired... I should, I should have known that. Uh, we only fired two shots, so we're fine for now. Oh, we got that uh, that angler book, too. We should probably read that. Although, I'm wondering what the benefits are going to be. Hmm. Yeah, I'm wondering what the benefits are going to be. Uh, something else we should actually look into. What is this? Hmm. Something else we should actually look, to, uh, look into is probably getting more scrap metal. And I say that because... Oh, God, there's more wolves. Not that I should be surprised there's more wolves. I mean, this is Timberwolf Mountain. Uh, I don't want to. I don't want to kill another one, or rather, I don't want to have to shoot another one. But I mean, I want to. I want to explore. Dang it! Is he coming this way, or am I kind of losing it for no reason? Okay, no, there he is. Oh God! Well, I know where I'm not going. See you later. <laughs> Bear and wolf mean no for me. This is a big fat no no. Oh, God, please don't see me. For a second, it looked like the bear had a little bit of a jitter, and I was like, please don't be, like, getting ready to pounce on me and, like, run towards me. I would be very upset. Now, if only we could make a toboggan and go sledding down this thing, we'd probably break our goddamn neck, and it would be game over. <laughs> but it'd still be fun. It'd still be fun. It'd be fun right up until the very end. No bear, right? No bear coming. Okay, so don't follow this. This is a bad place to go. Maybe let's do... You know what? Let's pick these cattails. God damn it. Come here. Let's get whatever food we can from these. Wait, just the cattail heads? I thought I got the... little sprigs from these guys, too. Oh, no, we're getting the stocks. All right, good. Just figure, you know, it's, it's food, it's... Not a ton of calories, but it's there. Then again, we probably actually shouldn't pick these yet, because I don't know how fast they go bad. Uh, let's see here. Cattails. Yeah, we don't need you. Drop all of them. Not to be rude, but we don't need you. Because we, we don't even do fires with Tinder anymore. You know, should I just get rid of the hide? I should probably take out... I should probably... Yeah, I should probably harvest the hide as well. Not that we're going to use it. Just that, it, you know, it'll get rid of the corpse. And that will uh, allow me to identify easier. You know, like, if we end up killing more wolves in this area, it'll allow me to... Lord. It'll allow me to identify which ones I've actually harvested and which ones I haven't. Where are they? I mean, every time I hear a wolf, I'm going to be a little paranoid. I mean, we did leave some of our first aid supplies behind. Alright. How long is it going to take me to harvest? 24 minutes? Go for it. It's not that cold. We're fine. Alright. Did I just... Wait a minute. Jesus. You're scaring me, dude. I thought I heard... Bark. Apparently I did not. So that's that's good news. Yeah. Good news indeed. So maybe what we'll do is... Oh God, this, this weather is so poopy. Oh, God, we're getting so wet. We're getting very, very soggy. Um, let's do a little bit more fishing. And then we'll go back in and we'll do some research. And... Are you for real? Oh, God, no. This is not Timberwolf Mountain, this is Bear Mountain. 
This is stupid jerkbag Bear Mountain. God, I hope it can't break down the door. God, I hope it can't break down the door. Oh, heck. We should also get our bullet. Jesus, I'm going to have to carry the bullets around. Where am I? I don't know. It's probably going to take quite a few bullets to put him uh, to put the bear down, though. Just, okay, please. So, two bears right near the cabin. I picked a super winner of a spot, didn't I? Good God. This is, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad, 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 bad. Okay, first off, start the fire. My God. There's a freaking bear. Right by the cabin. Oh, God, no. Oh, okay. Don't panic. Don't panic. Don't panic. There's a bear there. That's true. We may be able to shoot it from the door, which is cheesy. I, I, yeah. Certainly. However, it's a goddamn bear. Bears don't usually take very well to being shot. And by that, I mean, first off, they hate it. I mean, wouldn't you? And also, um, they don't seem to get affected by being shot very, very easily. Which kind of sucks. This also means I may be keeping the meat in here. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, should I keep the meat in here? Crap. I'm just, I'm not sure. Because if I put it outside, there's the possibility that the bear will come and get it. And I don't really like that possibility. I think that possibility is garbage, and I hate it. I have done wrong. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot man. I... God damn it. I let the stupid fire... Die. All right, you know, just drink. Crap. Eat this. Eat this. Um, drop this for now. No, god damn it. All right, wolf pelt. Where you at? Drop you. I know we got this mountaineering rope. I'm not sure when we're going to use that, uh, if ever. Five hours of research, huh? Let's do like two hours. See see how things get. Let's see. Let's also see exactly how wet we are after this. Because if this place is still poopy and like super allowing us to be soggy, I'm going to be very upset. Okay, now we're dry. Good. Uh, we are tired. We got some dry mouth going on. Let's still do some more research. I think we'll, yeah, we will finish researching the book, I think. But before we actually finish, we should... Good lord, we're getting thirsty. Um, before we actually finish the research, for one, we should drink. Second, I think we should check out exactly how good... What is this? Oh. Okay. Um... No, we want this angler. So fishing, yeah. So fishing time reduced by five percent. Eight percent chance of line break on catch. Hmm. So right now we're at novice, which is totally fine. Let's finish researching you. We're gonna be tired. I am very not looking forward to potentially going outside. Should probably get some more firewood, huh? Yeah. Alright, carry the bullets. I know it's a crap load of weight. But, I mean, if we run into a bear, I'd like to be able to defend ourselves. Where are you at, bear? Where are you at, dude? Leave this open just in case. Christ. Jesus. I hate this. That bear could be anywhere. Don't scare me. God damn it. 
Okay, I don't see it. So that's a good sign. Well, then again, it could be a terrible sign, because that may mean that it's right by us, and I just don't see it, because I'm being unobservant. Just keep an eye out. Any movement. Uh <gasps> Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. I just wanted to do some fishing, dude. I just wanted to do some fishing. Um, oh, God damn it. We can't outrun it. Can't, no, there's no way we're going to outrun the bear. Jesus Christ. There's no goddamn way. Um. Oh, boy. I suppose we should clean our gun. Maybe. And maybe sharpen our tools? <laughs> maybe that's a good uh, good idea? Time to look for shelter. Well, what? Oh, no, you're fine, dude. You're fine. Um. No, keep the book on you. Keep the book on you. You're at 92%. Let's sharp. I can't sharpen. Why no? Oh, probably because I put all my whetstones in here, huh? Right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, what is our gun at? 4... 91. I think we want to use the, the gun cleaning kit as well. No, no. Uh, gun. Clean it. Okay, 99% is good. Now, uh, you need to be sharpened, my friend. Sharpening 5%, that's good. And let's sharpen our kniff. Okay. What else do we want to do? We've got a lot of fishing line. Okay, we can't do anything but drop it, so let's so just leave it alone. Um, drink this. Just get it out of the way, because it is going bad. Moldy, salty crackers. Uh, I suppose we should eat them since they're going bad. Yeah. Um... Alright, let's start a fire. 100% chance, good. Start that up. We're going to get ourselves a ton of water. Because I think this is going to be essentially like our base of operations for now. Come on. Come on. I know, I'm right, I'm right there with you, dude. Please, hurry with the, the fire. Any day now, you'll finish. It also seems that there's an abundance of trees... So that's something. Actually, let's see. Are there any other connections to Timberwolf Mountain? Does not seem so. Does not seem so. That doesn't mean that there aren't any just on this particular that's map. There, it doesn't show any. Okay. First off, melt. Second, we're going to get all this boiled up. Which takes significantly less time. Thankfully. Okay, melt another liter. We're probably just going to use up all this fire. Yeah, we're going to use up all the fire for this. Because we end up drinking so much water. Okay, now let's boil all of it. Let's go down to, to uh, half half liters. All right, now boil. Please give me enough time. We might be able to do another half liter, maybe. Ah, it's looking kind of tight. Uh, we may have to add a stick. Oh you shit! Need to lay down. Ah, stick. Net fuel. Okay, good. Now, boil the water. Whew, okay. We're good. We're good. Alright. Uh, let's put some of our water away. 
We've got five kilograms. That's pretty nice. Uh, let... Come here. Damn it. Take a liter. Okay. How are we doing? Alright, we do need to drink, so let's, let's drink. So, uh, there's one thing that I, I kind of want to talk about. Just because, like, I was talking to the girlfriend about something the other day. And, uh, it just a couple things occurred to me. Like, while I have complaints about the area that we live in, in general, I find it to be superior to where I used to live. Um, and part of the reason for that is because there's a lot more wilderness, wilderness-y goodness in this area. So, I used to live near Chicago. And, quite frankly, uh, Chicago is not the greatest if you're kind of a nature-y person. Um, oh, please don't tell me I'm going to lose condition because I didn't drink. No, we're good. Alright, good. Um, so, like, girlfriend and I go on walks pretty frequently uh, nearby. Might as well eat these. Oh, no, no. God damn it. Um, you know what? No, put those in here because they're probably going to keep for a while. Um, we go for walks at a local reservoir. Um, oh, God, I don't want to go outside. Or, wait a minute. Lantern fuel. Oh, right, the ones, uh, the lantern fuel that I harvested from the, uh, the critters. Right, right, right. So, we, um... We go for walks at a local reservoir pretty often. Bear, please don't be nearby. I should, leave the, I should leave the door open. Guess I need to make a mad dash to get inside. And uh, that's one of the things that I really love about the, the area that I live in, is there there is a lot of nature available. Like where I used to live, you really can't. Like nature is difficult to find for the most part. You have to go into like forest preserves and stuff like that. Which isn't, you know, in and of itself a bad thing. I shouldn't drop off of this. I don't know if there's actually the possibility of causing the ice to break by doing so, but I'm not going to take that chance. Are you for real? Son of a... Biscuit. I hate this. I hate this. I could shoot the bear. Where would I do that from, though? I mean, he's right in the middle of the freaking thing. Shit. This is bad. This is really bad. Please go away. I should, you know what? Let's get some more water and then we'll come back out. Oh, my God. And, you know, it, it's it's all down to, like, what kind of person you are. Like, if you really like being in a city, then I don't think the area I live in would be, all, like, your favorite place in the world. Um, I mean, I, I actually live in a city, but um, I guess what I'm trying to say is, like, even though I live in a city, there's a lot of nature-y stuff that we can do nearby. Is, okay, was it just, like, the bear hadn't loaded in? Is that what, what happened? I look away and look back, and he's there. Yep, there he is. He just kind of poofed into existence. Jesus Christ. I I hate this. This is bad. This is really bad. Oh, Christ. Okay, let's let's avoid Mr. Bear for as long as possible. I'm betting he was attracted by the smell of fish. If that's even a thing in the game. Can't go fishing with him by uh, uh, n nearby. I, I just I can't. Son of a! How the hell am I gonna do this? God damn it! Just no. Okay, I can't put any more bullets in. Are you leaving? God, I hope so. just want food, dude. That's all I want. Just go away. Leave me alone. Wait, is there a... No. thought maybe there was a uh, drop...
drop a decoy kind of thing. Okay. Well, there's not. Um, oh, hell on earth. Please go away. Please go away. He's going to be able to fit in here. Guaranteed. Do I... Do I dare... Try to fish with that fat jerk by nearby? He's disappeared. Jesus. Ah... Uh... I already looked at everything here, right? There's nothing... Well, I mean, I left the newspaper roll behind, but what the hell am I going to do? Hit the bear with it? I don't think so. Jesus. I... Oh, God damn it. Why bear? Why? Okay. Fish for, like... Hang on. Back. No. Fish for, like, an hour. Well, okay, first I'm going to break the ice. Then I'm going to look. And then we're going to see what we're going to do. Peek outside. Bear? No bear. Right? Is that him? That might be the bear. Crap. No bear, no bear, no bear, no bear, please! Thought I heard. <sighs> that I heard footsteps. Jesus Christ. I hate this. Please, 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 please. No fish. I mean, those sound like hooved feet. Don't they? Yes, they do, and they're running. Oh, hell on earth. Please, no. Okay, is this fishing hole just, like, exhausted? God, no. Well, this is terrible. Three kilo almost four kilograms of bass. That is insane. Fuck this. Let's get out of here. Please, no bear. Please. Screw it. We're running. We're getting the hell out of here. I've risked enough. That was probably one of the stupidest things I have done in a very long time in this game. Okay, alright folks, I think that's going to do it for this episode. I hope you all did enjoy it, and if you did, you know what to do. That is going to do it for me, NotoriousBLT. I hope you have a fantastic day, and I will catch you all next time. Bye-bye, folks.